Hi folks, it's Duke in Maine. And I wanted to share with you my um, 22 long rifle brass de-rimming setup, uh, which I just finished uh, assembling with the assistance of my, uh, my buddy Andy Quinzani. And um, uh, the previous attempt used a um, two inch cylinder, air cylinder, which really just didn't have enough oomph to uh, to make things work. So what I've got here is a uh, three and a quarter inch uh, cylinder with the same air supply, and um, this one seems to run really, really well. Um, I did get a uh, custom ram uh, from a uh, fellow on Cast Bullets who uh, goes by the name of Chuck Buster. And um, he's in the tool and die business, and he's got a friend of his that he works with that uh, actually does the machining. Um, but what I've got is a uh, RCBS rock chucker press uh, mounted on an end plate that's welded to a piece of 7-inch uh, uh, I-beam. Uh, and on the uh, very end of it is mounted the uh, de-rimming uh, tool. Um, I've got the, uh, the end of the ram, the, uh, de-rimming punch is sitting there, uh, and that threads directly onto the end of the, uh, cylinder, uh, ram. The cylinder, in, in turn, is mounted to a, uh, plate that we welded onto this, uh, piece of, uh, I-beam. Uh, seems to have plenty of strength. It's a quarter-inch. Uh, regular uh, plate steel, hot rolled plate steel. The uh, cylinder has a uh, flat mounting plate with four four bolt holes. Then we were able to uh, drill some half inch holes and use some seven sixteenths bolts. Uh, gave us a little bit of adjustment uh, room, uh, both for the cylinder and for the ram, uh, so that we could get good uh, actuator uh, activity on the uh, on the tool. Um, you can see that it cycles at a pretty good speed. Because of the uh, amount of uh, volume in the uh, air cylinder, the uh, the ram um, does use up uh, quite a bit of uh, air volume, and so I'm finding that the compressor is uh, cycling uh, somewhat frequently. It's not outrageous. Um, I'm having to uh, sort out any of the federal cases. The uh, sizing die uh, that I have for this. Um, doesn't seem to like the extra thickness of the um, the federal cases. But you can see that this uh, this ram has uh, this three and a quarter inch cylinder has plenty of oomph for the job. Actually shoots the uh, the brass out the end of the uh, the um, tool. I don't know if you can see it flying through the air. I'm using a uh, small actuator switch here. Um, I'm thinking of. Uh, maybe permanently mounting that so I don't have to keep reaching for it um, and coming up with a uh, system here with a uh, piece of PVC pipe that I can put over the uh, the end of this to catch that brass that's flying out and have it just drop uh, straight into a tray. Um, but anyway, that's my uh, de-rimming set. Uh, total investment, I already had the RCBS press. Um, I spent about $65 on the uh, cylinder. Um, 
the RAM, I will uh, include a little more write-up uh, in the CAS Bullets forum on uh, what, I, what I did in terms of the, uh, the custom RAM and so forth. Uh, and share, we'll share that all with the uh, CAS Bullets Forum people. So thank you again.